For fast, cheap and reliable individual match tax cards and unopened products, check out traincardcollective.co.uk with the link below. And if you use the discount code WB10, you get 10% off individual cards. Hey guys, Barnaby here, back with another match tax 2018-19 video. Uh, now, before we get into this one, uh, just want to let you know, tomorrow is the release day for match tax 2018-19, um, Thursday the 27th of September. So obviously, if you're watching this video after that, then ignore this. And tomorrow I'm going to be live streaming um, on the day of the release of Match Tax and hopefully opening a load of Match Tax on the stream and also uh, playing some of the brand new Match Tax app uh, which will also be released tomorrow. Um, so yeah, make sure to tune in to that. It will be starting at 6.30pm and yeah, live right here on YouTube. Um, so just come onto my channel at 630 and it should be there. And yeah, I hope to see as many of you on there as possible. But yeah, in today's video, we do have four mini tins to open. So uh, again, thanks to Tops for letting me get my hands on these mini tins early. I filmed a few videos on their channel. Make sure to check them out with the link down below. Um, but yeah, each of these tins do contain 45 cards inside, which is the same as last year. However, uh, as with all the products this year, they have increased the price. It's now £7 instead of the £6 that it was last year. Um, so yeah, I mean, I've already talked a lot about the increase in price and I think it's very unfortunate. The poll on the first video I did where I asked you guys uh, if you're going to be collecting or not, it was only 60-40, so 60% of you said that you would, but 40% said it would be too expensive for you. Um, so yeah, that is pretty bad and I think upping the price again was not a good idea uh, in my opinion. But yeah, they have one good thing about this year's collection, along with um, new design and everything, is they have changed the limitation system, um, where now you can get any of four different limitations, whereas before it was just one player in each um, product. So yeah. On the back here, you can see we've also got improved odds. And for some reason, they've just written them differently on here. Um, they are actually the same odds as on the most packs this season. Um, but yeah, obviously, they've just written the numbers differently. Um, but you're still just as likely to get a gold, silver or bronze as you are uh, in the most packs. So yeah, let's get this first tin straight open and see what we get inside. Um, so the elimination should be uh, on the top. Uh, yeah, I think that'll be the elimination. Um, and we do have in the tin Johansson and Caballero, Zahor, then Christie. Um, you do have the new Matchtax app digital packet there, uh, as you can see, which you can scan uh, on the Matchtax app, which uh, releases along with the collection tomorrow. Uh, we've also got Jermaine Defoe, uh, Hernandez, De La Feu, Ryan, Yedlin, Ozil, Taylor, Jagielka. Then Cesar Azpilicueta uh, with 90 on defence, David Silva and Juan Mata, and then Aurier, a few good players there. Rui Patricio as well, Josh Murphy, Pritchard, Francis, Zabaleta, Holobas, Coleman, Chilwell, Atsu, Moses, Edison, Pogba, uh, and then fans' favourite, Benjamin Mendy, fans' favourite, Arnholt, fans' favourite, Dominic Solanke of Liverpool, and then uh, fans' favourite, Mooney as well there, and then fan favourite Maguire, and also Sol Bamba fan favourite, and then we do have Ruben Neves star player, De Bruyne star player, Cater, Leicester City's badge, Newcastle's badge, Arsenal's badge, and it looks like we might have a hundred club at the end here. We've also got Ashley Young there, man of the match with 86 on defence, Oriol Romeo, and then Firmenia, and we do have a hundred club. At the end of the tin, that is a brilliant pull. It is Hector Bellerin's 100 Club. Probably one of the more questionable ones in there, um, but still a 100 Club nonetheless. And for the actual match that's game, he does only have an 11.5 million value. Um, so potentially a really good card to use uh, in your match tax team. So yeah, really chuffed with that. Before we've even finished, well, got onto the limit session, we've already got a fantastic pull in the first tin. Uh, and then we do have, will it be a bronze, silver or gold? 
It is another bronze limited edition card, unfortunately. So we are not doing well at all um, with the bronze, silvers, and gold. Uh, if you did watch my multi pack opening as well. Um, but yeah, hopefully that can change in the future tins. Obviously, the Bellerin makes it a bit better. Uh, getting 100 club, you can't really complain. Um, but yeah, there's nine shiny cards in each tin. And uh, if we have a look at this one, um, so here's the shinies we got. We've got three star players, three badges, and then three man the matches. The 100 club was not even included in the shinies, which is pretty generous of them. Um, so that's not bad going at all. All right, so on to the second mini tin now, and hopefully our luck can improve. Um, so if we stick Henderson in the first one. Um, yeah, so you can get any of Pogba, Henderson, uh, Ali, or um, Sane in these mini tins. Um, but yeah, still, it is still heavily weighted against the golds, um, but slightly less bad than last year. Definitely a better system than last year, and I will make a video soon um, just checking uh, how much it was completed last year compared to this year. Um, but yeah, we got Davies and then Scherler, Moutinho, Rowles, uh, Fabianski, and the another code card. Um, we've also got Michael Keane there, and Laporte for City, Valencia as well, Hugo Lloris, and also uh, Kuyate and Johnny Evans, Mustafi, Olivier Giroud, then we've got the possession card, Fabian Delph, Romelu Lukaku, um, with 83 on attack for him. Uh, then we do have some rising stars here with Walker Peters, and then a fan's favourite, Ben Foster there, uh, Benjamin Mendy, a fan's favourite as well. And so about the focus. Um, we've got Diego Jota, um, and Diabetes, and then Cessnion, fans favourites, and that just takes on to the nine shinies uh, in this tin. Uh, so we've got Arnautovic, Ket Emmerich Aubameyang, and Bayton Gibson, those are all star players and star signings. Uh, then we do have the Tottenham Hotspur badge, Watford badge, West Ham badge, and also Andreas Christensen at Man of the Match, which is a nice one to get. Edison at uh, Man of the Match, he's got 99 on his defence. And we've also got Jabravka as well, Man of the Match for Newcastle. Um, so, no 100 club in that one. Uh, we might be able to get some sort of idea from these four mini tins of um, what rate the 100 clubs are inserted at. Um, but yeah. Once you guys have opened some of these tins, please do let me know in the comments down below. Oh, I'm forgetting something quite important there. Um, we do, of course, have the edition. Will it be bronze, silver, or gold? We've had a bronze so far. This is going to be a Paul Pogba. And it's another bronze. This is getting a bit ridiculous now. Uh, because if you didn't see my multi-pack opening, I opened three multi-packs and got three bronzes. And I've opened two tins and got two bronze as well. So that's five out of five. A clean sweep of bronze and edition cards. Of course, I did also manage to get a silver Deli Alley. Um, just in a lucky pack in the multi-packs. Um, but yeah, in the actual limited editions that you're guaranteed, I'm doing awfully so far this year. Um, we've just got bronzes. Hopefully, that can change by the end of this video. Um, surely it's got to. Um, yeah, moving on to uh, number three, we've got another Paul Pogba there, it's just the colour uh, that matters. We've got Nathan Redmond, to start this one off, and um, Tomkins, new uh, app there, that's the code. Uh, Lascelles, then Socrates, and Alderweireld, a Lalana, a Wakeit, and David Luiz, a Wakeit as well. Uh, then we've got Sergio Aguero. Uh, and Cresswell, James Madison, a wake at card, um, the upcoming player for Leicester. We've got Matt as well, Fabregas, Jesus, and then McTominay, um, rising star for Manchester United. Everyone's got Walker Peters, rising star for Tottenham, and Ben Foster, fans' favourite, Chris Rudd, fans' favourite, and then Monreal. Uh, fans favourite and Josh Sims rising star. We then do have star player Kevin De Bruyne. That's a pretty nice pull. He's got 86 on his attack. 
Uh, Nabi Keita as well, Alexis Sanchez star player, he's got 88 on his attack. Um, so he actually rates Sanchez above De Bruyne, uh, which is interesting. We've got Tottenham Hotspur's badge, Watford's badge, West Ham's badge. And then Carl Walker, um, the English defender, 96 on defence on his Man of the Match card, which is pretty good going. Uh, we've also got Kennedy and Patterson, and then we do have another 100 clubs. So... We might not be doing too well with the Limistitions in this opening, but we certainly are with the 100 clubs. Two out of three tins so far have included one. And this is a pretty pricey one. It's Raheem Sterling with a £17 million value. Of course, 100 on his tag. He didn't have a great World Cup, um, the English winger for City. Um, but yeah, of course, he had a brilliant season at Manchester City last year. And that does take us on to the limitation. Will it be a bronze, silver or gold Paul Pogba? It is a silver. We have finally broken the dock and got something other than a bronze. Um, so, yeah, that is a promising sign. Um, it took us six products to actually get something other than a bronze. Um, but we do finally have it. That is Paul Pogba, silver limitation. So I'm happy with that one. That is, of course, a need for the collection. And we do still have one tin remaining um, to hopefully get a gold. That would be nice. Uh, we've certainly opened enough products that we'd be likely to get a gold because they are about one in five. Um, and this is my seventh product that I'm opening. Um, but yeah, let's get it straight open and find out what is inside. So... First up, we will of course take the limitation off the top and leave them till the end. Um, so it is a Man City midfielder this time. Um, so some of you may know who that is. Um, but we've got Gabbiadini, Vieto, uh, Felipe Anderson, Pereira, and then the code card. Uh, and also Matt Ritchie there, and Ramsey, Gay, and then... Uh, Moussa Dembele, Sadio Mane uh, with only 82 on attack, maybe deserves a bit more than that. Aspel Equator, he's got 90 on defence. Uh, we've got David Silva as well, and then Lamila, and also Begovic, Yarmolenko, Joe Hart, Trippier, Robertson, Rudiger, and then the fans' favourites, uh, Patrick Van Amholt card, also Rising Star Solanke, and fans' favourite Ake. And then we do have uh, fan favourite Jordan Pickford. I do really like the design of these fans favourite and rising star cards, by the way. I've also got fans favourite Ingolo Kante and then Chris Wood, uh, Aaron Moy star player, Andrew Scherler star player, Callum Wilson star player, the Southampton badge, Brandon Hove Albion badge, the Everton badge, and then we do have Isquero, uh, followed by Hun Min Song, his man of the matches now and Adrian Silva, and another 100 club. Wow, what an opening this has been. This has really bolstered my collection of 100 clubs. This time it is Tottenham's Jan Vertonghen, um, with of course 100 on defence. Uh, he's a pretty cheap one, slightly more expensive than Bellerin, with a 12 million pound value. Uh, but wow, three out of four, of the tins have contained 100 clubs. I'm sure that can't be what the odds are actually like, um, but still, really, really good going. I'm very happy with that in today's opening. Um, so yeah, let me know if you, once you guys have opened some tins, what kind of um, amount of time you are getting 100 clubs, because three out of four is really, really good. Obviously, we do still have the final limitation card, and in this one, it is another silver. Um, so not too bad going. So we've got 300 clubs, two silvers and two bronzes in four mini tins. I think that is a decent opening. Um, by the way, the Sane card does look pretty good for your team. Um, he has got just a 9.5 million pound value. And um, yeah, 93 on his attack stats. Um, so it could be a really good one for your match sex team. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. If you did, please do smash that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you're new around here for more match sex content. And of course, I'll see you next time.